Good evening, everybody, and thanks for joining us. I'm Sean Mooney. Amanda Gomez has the night off. With the worst of the pandemic now behind us, many Tucsonans are out and about this Cinco de Mayo, and that means law enforcement is on the lookout for impaired drivers. News for Tucson's Angelique Lazardi is live on the west side with more. Angelique. Yeah, well, good evening, Sean. That is right. The main objective for many Tucsonans today on Cinco de Mayo was to have a good time, but also to have a plan to get home safely. Back to normal. You get to go out, you get to no mask. And everybody, you can see everybody's face and their reactions. <laughs> This Cinco de Mayo, it was back to business at El Charro Cafe and back to socializing for many Tucsonans. It's really nice to be able to experience this day with my family and my friends that have been with me forever. And, you know, last year, the two years before, it's been really awful, you know. But while it's okay to get out and have a good time again, if you plan to drink, have a plan. It's a lift all the way to Oro Valley. That's my plan. Tucson police tells News 4 Tucson the Southern Arizona DUI task force will be out in full force. If you decide to take that risk, if you decide to drive while you're impaired, either by alcohol or by drugs, there will be officers out uh, patrolling the streets looking for that. Uh, if you do get caught, the, the penalties are severe. Uh, you could face jail time. Don't drink and drive. Be safe. Care about the community. Now, the DUI task force wants to make it really clear that they're not just going to be patrolling tonight, but they are going to be out in full force this entire coming weekend. We're live here on the west side. I'm Angelique Lazardi. News for Tucson.